I see blue, blue. Good morning, guys. I got to cook breakfast in the cabin for the first time. We are having eggs, bacon, and fruit. I have other things for breakfast, too, but we're waiting for tomorrow. I mean, we're going to be here a while. We're in this together. How is it, guys? Good. It's extra good because it's in the cabin. It's good. I just <laughs> we don't have salt and pepper. Banana. I just ate a banana. So after breakfast, we did our normal routine. I laid out the kids' clothes, they had to brush their teeth, do their hair, and now they met me here. What'd you guys have to meet me here with? Books. A book. And we spent about 10 minutes reading or trying to read. We're gonna, that's not the last time we'll be reading during school today, okay? Abram, this is a journal for you. It's green, and it's for social studies. So when it was for my hands, I can touch you. can't touch right now. You gotta let the kids focus, okay? The kids finished all of their core classes at noon, and now they're doing their devotional. But now I'm organizing school and our little section for the whole rest of the month that we're gonna be here, so. Okay, so right here we have Juliet's drawer. She's got her flashcards. She did, she's doing this puzzle activity that should take her like all the rest of the whole week to do. Okay, and then Symphony, these are her supplies that her teacher sent with her along with the little treat. I guess this can be Symphony's drawer. These two things for Abram. All right, guys. School is over for the day. We're finishing up with some coloring. I'm so proud. Everybody did an amazing job. We did so good not arguing with mommy, not too much. We got to still work on it. And you too, little lady. What's up, guys? So, got the dining room table all prepped for epoxy. It only took me all day. I'm going to pour the epoxy now and put a light coat on here. Make sure there's not any leaks this time. Look at me you go, guys. Guys, I want to move here. I want to sell our house and move here. So cute. There's a whole bunch of leaks, it wasn't sealed off. The first coat I put on, remember last time, was just the surface. And um, that basically sealed the surface of the table. But now the edges need to be sealed off, so basically I gotta let this run mostly dry before I put the next coat, which is the heavy duty layer. As you can see, it's basically draining out right here. Not much I can do though. Ooh, yummy. No, that looks great. Thanks, Ben. The job I'm getting ready to do here at the cabin is in this room right here. The gray room. The gray furniture room. I got some paint to match it. If you guys recall, the top of this dresser while I was um, traveling tore to shreds. It was just a laminate layer on top, which is actually fine. It actually worked out because the, the surface under it is very paintable. And then I bought this from somebody completely different. I'm thinking maybe paint the top part of it to match the furniture or the sides. Something. I'm going to add that color to the mirror as well. That's supposed to be coming through that door. Oh. Forgot. Sorry. Ooh, I want to paint. This seems like a job I could do. What? You're working in the kitchen now. I know, but I'm just doing dishes. This is so cool. How'd you get the exact same color? I just eyeballed it. No, then... you did not. It's identical. I brought a drawer with me. Color match. So, 
what mirror do you think we should do, babe? The mirror that it came with, or this mirror over here, and I could paint it to match the furniture. Definitely think this mirror. That mirror? Yeah, okay. Yeah, that mirror is ugly. But, I mean, I feel like when I've stayed in Airbnbs with my friends, we go in the bathroom and get ready. There's not even a mirror. It's like, there's like one common mirror that we use, or you go so in you the bathroom. So you don't think we need a mirror? No, I don't think, I think if you just put the dresser there with the TV above it, it would be just fine. I like that. Think outside of the mirror. So, so no mirror it. and put the TV above the dresser. Yes. Right where I intended it to be. Right there. Right yeah. Such Why such. do you need a mirror? In I it? mean, like if you really wanted it, you could do something like a, put a mirror like here. a, you know, that. Or kind. I could take that mirror and just like put it on the ceiling above the bed. This would be where the married couples want to stay. Should I put it right there? No, you shouldn't. Oh my gosh. Tacky. I'm so tacky. Nia is taking care of this bathroom. Yes, sir, Bob. What you doing in there, babe? Scrub a dub in the bathtub and <laughs> scrub a dub dub and clean in the tub. <laughs> you funny. Whoa. <laughs> we have our little neighbors over, Junior and Kinsey. They ate dinner with us. I'm not the double stuffed Oreos. Would you like double stuffed Oreos? Yes. No, thank you. I'd like Okay, take as many as you want except five. Okay. Okay. Alright guys, I'm walking around from room to room, putting in my peace and calming, getting all the diffusers ready. I have one in just about every bedroom. I just don't have one upstairs yet. So let's go do the master. Actually, let me show you guys Matthew and Andrea's room. They're coming tonight. Did we tell you guys that? We're having guests this weekend, which is so exciting. Dun, da, da, da. It's so nice. Here's the little diffusies. All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Don't forget, he loves you, and remember to love each other.